Brynn, it's Katie and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new and so you can subscribe. The button is always down below. Post video, I still panning and more. And I'm super, super excited for today's video. But first off, Merry Christmas. It is Christmas day when I'm filming this and I hope you guys are having a great Christmas for your family, friends, whoever you choose to spend today with. And I hope you're having a great day full of whatever you want today to be. And happy Saturday. I guess when you guys see this, it might be Sunday. Monday or Monday. Happy whatever day it is when you are watching this. You do not celebrate Christmas. But I just want to say Merry Christmas and hope everyone's having a great day. But today's video, as you know by the title, is going to be my annual What I Got for Christmas Christmas haul video. I am so excited. I love filming these videos. I'm obviously very thankful and grateful for family, for any gifts I have received. Um, and this video isn't meant to brag. It's just honestly a YouTube tradition with a lot of people. Like a lot of people love filming these and I mean they're so fun it's like fun to share and stuff it's fun to like you know share this kind of video for Christmas and I love it just the background and everything and I just you know love sitting like in front of my Christmas tree filming this type of video it's just so fun and that kind of stuff and then this is like almost like the vlogmas finale like it's kind of funny because if i do post this on sunday i said in my vlogmas video like i won't be saying like see you tomorrow in that video yet here i am filming on christmas which i've never really done like I've never filmed like a sit down like talky video on Christmas so this is super weird to be doing but I honestly am living for it. Like I'm loving it just you know getting this time to film just one video is great. Like I'm here for it. But yeah like I said this isn't meant to be a braggy video so if you don't like this kind of stuff just click off. No reason to hate. But yeah I'm really excited about this so let's just get into what I got for Christmas this year. Let's do this. And yeah, like I said, I never film on Christmas. You know, there's a first time for everything. Yeah, this is super weird filming on Christmas. I just have to say that again because I never do that. Well, there's a first for everything, I guess. But anyways, let's get to the things. Okay, so the majority of my gifts are from my parents and stuff. So I'm just gonna share those. And then I have a couple honorable mention gifts that I'll mention at the end. So first thing I have from my parents are some shower gels from Philosophy, which I love. Um, So they got me three. The first one is called Holiday Pajamas. Just looks like that. Hmm, that one smells good. I don't know what it is. It probably has the scents on it, let's be real. Um, but these are like shower gels and bubble baths. I also recently bought myself one of these and stuff, but I think this is like a probably like cranberry type scent. I don't know, there's like very minimal like info on the bottle, but then holiday pajamas and it's like a 16 fluid ounce. So these will last me a long time. We'll have to buy a shower gel for a long time. And then the next one is sparkling holly berries, which obviously smells like holly berries. Again, another 16 fluid ounce. This one, the seal isn't broken on though. Mm, that one smells even better. We love that. And then the last one is a is a baby one. Well, not baby, but it's a little bit smaller. And this is a six fluid ounce. And this is in hot cocoa. That smells good. Nice hot cocoa. But I love those shower gels, so love that. The next thing I'm super excited about, I I was literally like stunned to see this, but my but they got me this mug which says I woke up gorgeous 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 which is basically a play on like I woke up gorgeous it also reminds me of that song like I woke up like this blah. but it's just this cute little travel corgi mug we love it we love corgis I didn't know I'm obsessed with corgis so love this and it's like a travel mug and it looks to be a travel mug, which I love. Don't know if I'll necessarily bring this with me on the go, but it's still cute. And I think it'd be great even like bringing it up the stairs to my room, I guess, <laughs> to film and stuff. Drinking coffee while filming, yes, please. Honestly, I might even have a chocolate bomb in this today because that's, that's the vibe, that's the mood. 
but I love this. Absolutely love it. The next thing I could have known I was getting because my mom had me pick it out, but I love Lindor truffles. So she got me this um, set and stuff. So it has milk chocolate, dark chocolate, white chocolate, 60% extra dark chocolate, and milk chocolate of caramel and stuff. And I absolutely love these. These will get eaten very soon because I honestly love Lindor truffles. Truffles, the best. And then the next thing that I got is this um, sheet mask, 14 day sheet mask set and stuff. This is the I Do Care, I guess, sheet mask set. I think that's what the brand is and stuff. And I haven't actually opened this to look at it yet. So I kind of want to. So we have like a bunch of different sheet masks. Yes, the brand is I Do Care. So we have In The Zone, Port and Tidying, Sheet Mask. We have the Brightening Citrus Sheet Mask. The purple one, which is a Acai Berry Mask, the Lotus Flower Mask, a Distressing Mud Worth Mask. And I love how like each type, you do get two masks so you can try it more than once. And I just think it's like a really cute set for somebody that likes sheet masks or just for relaxation. I'm definitely like a sheet mask girl. Like I love them so much. So next I got this organizer, which I had mentioned wanting in my um, Christmas like wish list video. And so I got this organizer with like a bunch of little slots. And this is what I'm going to be keeping my letters for my letter board in. I'm gonna actually try and organize them today. I'm really excited about it. It's a really good organizer. You got like a bunch of different slots and I even have more slots than like letters if that makes sense like i have more like it goes further than a to z is i guess is what i'm trying to say and i absolutely love that so the next thing i got it's gonna be really hard to show on camera but i'm gonna try my best is this like laptop um tabletop thing so it's like almost like a laptop easel i don't really know what to call it i'm gonna try and get videos of some of the things probably like the bigger items or something um but this is by the brand Merco m-r-o-c-o this is what it looks like it's so hard to see so i'll definitely have a video of this i also want to kind of like show this in action so this is nice because it's like a tabletop so i can like set my laptop on it for editing which i love and it'll also be great for like other things in bed because i pretty much i never sit at a desk i'm always pretty much sitting at my bed the only time i sit at a desk i honestly don't even technically have a desk i have a vanity um which is where i like i do my makeup of course the only time i sit over there is like when i do my makeup and when i film i typically other times like i edit in my bed i edit on the couch i never edit like at an actual desk desk. I just put my laptop on like my lap, but this will be nice instead of having like my laptop on my actual lap. It'll be so nice. So I'm excited about that and I'm excited to get use out of this, out of that. And it'll also be great for when we record podcasts because I can like literally put my laptop on there and I can read the document we use off of when we record on that. I feel like it'll just be a lot easier and it'll make my life better you know just a little bit the next i got a product i've wanted to try for a while but i never would buy it on my own i don't know why i just i wouldn't but this is the Paula's choice exfoliate um skin perfecting two percent bha exfoliant um with salicylic acid and it's supposed to just be a really good like liquid exfoliant and i'm going to try this tonight because i'm so curious about this after hearing about this for a while definitely have to keep you guys updated but i'm super excited to try this out and i've heard a lot about Paula's choice for a while um if you have any like favorite products that i should definitely check out from Paula's choice let me know down below because I'll definitely check it out. But I'm super excited about this and yeah, excited to try this and happy to have received that. And I was thinking there was something else in this, but my mom gave me this like little tin and she put this necklace that was also in like my Christmas wish list video. Um, but this is the Just Shop necklace. That's what it looks like. It's a sunflower, which I absolutely love. 
kind of want to take out the plastic. That's what it looks like. It's super pretty and I can't wait to wear this. I love more dainty necklaces. That's more of my thing, I guess. And I absolutely love that necklace. Like it's so, so cute. Like, and I love the rose gold detailing. Also love how there's like silver for like the inside of the subplot rather than it all being like the same shade, I guess. Love that, love this. Then the last tangible gift I received is a new pair of sneakers because I've worn through um sneakers. I haven't gotten, I think I asked for sneakers in 2018 into 2019 that Christmas. So like 20 Christmas 2018. Um and I had sneakers as the last time and I've pretty much worn through all my sneakers just that happens. Um so I saw these pair of Nikes and I kind of told my mom about them. This is what they look like. I, per usual, you know, I'm obsessed with rose gold mentioned in so many different videos. Um, but it has like the rose gold Nike check mark, which I love. And they're like, like a soft, like rose faint pink color, which I like. And I love like kind of like the arch support on these. They're super cute. And I'm just obsessed with like the rose gold, like faint pink detailing. Oh, the whole sneaker looks beautiful and I can't wait to wear these. Absolutely can't wait. And I love these. I love all the gifts that I received this year um, and stuff from my parents. They're the best, honestly. I'm obsessed. I'm so grateful like for all these things. I'm absolutely obsessed and I can't wait to try things I haven't tried like the sheet masks, the liquid exfoliant. Can't wait to use that corgi mug and that kind of stuff. And then like other things I received, um, boring to show so i didn't want to show them but i will give them honorable mentions so like i did get money also from my parents because i want to buy a new laptop since mine's from like 2014 and then i also kind of want like a new camera since i do record off my phone i would love to like not do that all the time like i would just love a camera even just like for vlogging purposes and stuff i would just i've been wanting one for a while and that kind of stuff so so yeah, so they did end up giving money, which I'm super grateful for. So yeah, thanks mom and dad. And then I got money from like other family members, like gra my grandparents um, and stuff. So I'm definitely gonna put money to good use. And then my aunt did give me a Amazon gift card. So um, thanks for that. Um, most of my family is not watching this video, but just thought I would mention. It has just kind of what I got for Christmas, of course. I always usually mention everything, but I'm super grateful for what I got and that kind of stuff. Of course, you know, if you know me, you know, I'm always grateful and I always express gratitude and that kind of stuff. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this Christmas haul for 2021. It's crazy of how many I've done these, how many of these I've done. Like I did one in 2015, 2016, 2017, 2018, 2019, 2020, and 21. So I guess this is my seventh one, which is absolutely insane to me. Like I baffled, like it honestly, like, I don't know. It just, it just is crazy to even like picture i guess i don't know but i hope you guys enjoyed this let me know what you got for christmas down below i'd love to hear what you got always love like seeing people's christmas hauls i will be watching these and like hearing what other people got i'd love to know so please let me know down below and be sure to subscribe if you are already because i have so much coming up in the end of this year i think i have like probably before 2021 ends i have probably two videos two other videos i want to do and stuff so so yeah stay tuned for that be sure to subscribe so you don't miss it and yeah thank you guys so much for watching thank you guys so much for watching vlogmas as well it really means a lot to me like this time of year this year was a little bit harder for me which i kind of mentioned in yesterday's video um but vlogmas was just such like a great thing for me and this is a great way this video and just and just vlogmas as a whole is a great way to end all but yeah once again, I hope you enjoyed today's video and I will see you in my next video very soon, which might or might not be my Project Pan finale. Bye.